everyone, it's Madison today. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to achieve this really gorgeous glowy look that you would get in the summertime, but you can get it in the fall and the winter time. So I'm gonna show you guys three different ways to get this look using the Javanese Robe Like a Pro. So now let's go ahead and get on into it. All right, so first off, we're gonna prep the skin using the Javanese Radiance Primer. So what this is gonna do, it's basically a weightless texture that is really gonna blur out the skin and just look absolutely stunning underneath your foundation. It really honestly just gives you this really nice glow that makes you look really healthy and brings that summertime to the fall and the winter. Yeah. <laughs> And also this primer is really gonna help elongate the wear of your foundation, and it's really gonna blur out any imperfections that you may have. All right, so for look number one, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the liquid light shade at number two, and I'm gonna mix it in with more of a lighter coverage foundation. What's awesome about this set, you guys, is the fact that it comes with so many different shades that work for any skin tone. That's what I really, really like about it, because I'm a little bit more, I have those like pink tones in my skin, and if I grab something that's too pink, it's gonna look really muddy, so that's why I'm taking shade number two to kind of cancel that out. Oh, am I almost out of this one? <laughs> Don't you hate it when you're almost out of foundation? Serious fail. <laughs> So basically what I did is I just took two parts of the foundation and then a little drop of the highlighter just so I can bring a really subtle glow to the skin. This is really gonna give me that really gorgeous lip from within look that's just gonna make you look super healthy. Yes, because hello, that's what you want your skin to look like. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and just lightly blend this into my skin with my beauty blender. So now that my foundation is all blended into my skin, you guys can see how it really brings that really nice, fresh, glow, dewy look to the skin that makes you look more healthy, more alive, and it just gives you that really fresh look, which is awesome. I'm loving this. <laughs> All right, so for look number two, I wanna show you guys a little bit more dimension with your highlight. So first off, we're gonna start off using the same Radiance Primer just to create that blank canvas. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take the liquid light in shade number two, and I'm gonna apply this to the high points of my face. And what this is gonna do, it's gonna create that strobing effect underneath your matte foundation. So I'm just gonna dab a little bit on my fingers and I'm gonna apply it on the high points of my cheeks. And this just kind of shapes and lifts your face. I'm gonna take my beauty blender and I'm just gonna blend it out a little bit. It's a little bit easier than my fingers because I got these long nails. <laughs> but you can use your fingers as well. It's just a little bit easier for me to use. <laughs> and I love using shade number two again, just because it really counteracts all that redness that I have in my skin, because you guys can tell I've got a lot of redness going on. I'm also gonna put it a little bit on the tip of my nose to give you that little button nose look like, I love that. And then a little bit down the bridge, and then also a little bit on the forehead, because I want to have my highlight on fleek. Yes. I love it on my chin too. And then also I'm gonna put a little bit above my cupid's bow because what this is gonna do, it's gonna make your lips look a little bit poutier and a little bit fuller. And I can use that. Oh, that's pretty. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> All right, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my matte foundation and I'm gonna place it on top of my highlight. And what this is gonna do, it's gonna give you that really natural glow from within that's gonna add that dimension to the skin. But again, it's gonna be natural, which I really like about it. So I'm just gonna take my beauty blender and just put a light coverage over my highlight. I love this, you guys, because when you want that matte finish, if you have like oily skin, and then you have the glow coming from there, but it doesn't make you look like you're oily. It just makes you look like you're healthy, but you can still get that matte foundation look. And then you don't end up looking like a shiny mess. <laughs> All right, so this is what my skin looks like with the matte foundation on top of that highlight. And as you guys can see, it just brings the most beautiful, subtle glow to the cheekbones. It's stunning. Like, I definitely recommend this for every day because it does seem like it's a little bit extra, but it's not. It's really easy to apply, yet it makes you look really just that healthy, glow, fresh makeup look. And people are gonna look at you and be like, oh my God, your skin looks gorgeous. All right, so next up what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you guys my easy everyday go-to routine, but with my favorite powder foundation. So again, we're gonna start off using the Radiance Primer to get that glow. Just wanna press that into the skin. You can just tell how dewy that makes it look. Oh, I love it. All right, so now that I have that Radiance Primer on my skin, I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my powder foundation, and I'm just going to buff this into the skin. 
You guys are seriously gonna see the glow come through this powder foundation. It's amazing. See, you can see just how it's glowing. Oh, loving it. Highly recommend it. And this is literally just primer and powder foundation. How quick and easy is that for like getting ready for work or if you have kids? Oh, it's like perfect. All right, so now I wanna be a little bit extra and I wanna go in with a Jabinus pixelated finishing powder. So I'm gonna take my fan brush and I'm just going to dust this in there and I'm gonna apply this to the high points of my cheek. And also the other parts of my face, a little bit down the bridge of my nose. This is just a really soft powder that's gonna give you a soft flicker of light where it's not gonna to be too much. All right, so this is the finished look and basically just using the Radiance Primer, a little bit of powder foundation, and a little bit of that pixelated powder. And what it does, it just gives you that really soft, natural glow. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to comment down below which look was your favorite glowy look, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.